My name's Aisha Seymour. I'm, I'm a forensic biologist with the Australian Federal Police, but I also am studying a Master's in uh, Forensic Anthropology. Forensic Anthropology is looking at skeletonised or decomposed remains and often in a sense to identify them. Generally there's a caseload, so you sort of local cases where remains may have been found that require identification. Um, some forensic anthropologists um, have case management, a case management load with autopsies and are attached to mortuaries as mm -hmm. well. And this case, Bones, is the, I think the character that portrays the forensic anthropologist. The time it takes for analysis takes a, long, a lot longer than what's depicted, obviously. It would be a lot more boring for a TV show. And sometimes the certainty that they have with the, you know, oh yes, that's a 30-year-old male with, you know, this, this and this and a limp kind of thing when it's very, um, particularly anthropology, it's not quite that definitive and there's always ranges and there's always limitations to what you can say, which mm -hmm. is not portrayed by the shows. The advice would be listen to the evidence in the context of all the evidence that you'll be hearing. Don't get frustrated with the, the expert because they're not saying um, the definitive, yes, that's that person or this person because it's not really able to be said. Right. Well, forensic anthropology is even rarer to get a position than forensic biology. In Australia, we get about 350 homicides a year. About one in 50 of those are buried. So that's about one buried body per state per year. And New South Wales, with the greatest population in Australia, yeah. is about 10 skeletonised human cases a year. We just do not have the caseload in Australia as perhaps the US, for mm -hmm. example. So there's one forensic anthropologist that works in uh, Queensland, one in Victoria, one in South Australia, one in Western Australia and one in New South Wales. And perhaps a researcher from one of the unis will do the odd thing every now and again because of the sheer lack of cases, if you like. Not a very great demand at all.